guys and welcome back to my youtube channel i'm just on a date with my son we went to go and get some food and now we are walking back home and i'm just hoping that he doesn't drop my phone don't worry i won't you better not but it's hard to hold it but we're almost home we're almost home so we are now about approximately 400 meters yep wait what To my youtube channel my name is nicole tafadwa chioda aka tara banks and if this is your first time joining my youtube channel please welcome please do not comment please do not forget to comment to like and to subscribe guys welcome to vlogmas episode two i hope you guys watched the first one and i hope you guys enjoyed it like i said i'm gonna try my best to be like very consistent in giving you guys content for how i'll be spending my december holidays guys today is a tuesday and it is the um, what is today's date it is oh my gosh i don't know what the date is i think it's the 19th or somewhere there but it's it's a tuesday and i'm going to work i'm going to Ruatangata. it's a four hour shift and um when i come back from it i'm just going to study i'm i plan on not sleeping guys i'm one of those students ne? who would sing sevens are well under pressure like even when i was still at varsity and i was doing my qualification i would know about a test like three weeks in advance would see guys on this day and the mere fact that i would be writing at 5 p.m yo the night before to study and then just wake up and go to the library and study so that's just kind of been the student that i am and right now i don't have a choice i have to finish my level three in health and well-being and submit everything by thursday night so tonight i'm not sleeping at all i'm just going to do all the assessments then i'll be left to the practical assessments which i'm waiting for from my um educator our educator from the company because she assists me and she just has to like type them and send them back to me then i can just submit and know always i'm done but guys yeah i hope you guys are having a good december i hope you guys are keeping safe i hope you guys are okay and you're spending time with your families or if you're still at work i hope you guys are having fun but yeah guys this is day one of this vlog and it is a tuesday but you probably won't see me today because i finish at 11 p.m and mangbe and your funda so nothing interesting is going to happen guys i just want to tell you an interesting fact about new zealand okay oh, the lip gloss not in like is a weird, but anyway shout out to my skin for doing the things so i got these flowers how pretty are they I know right and then i got this vase at the warehouse but can i tell you something guys one thing i've told myself is that i'm really not gonna buy flowers in this country anymore because their weeds or their grass their weeds are flowers this is apparently considered okay now it's dying because it's been here for i think almost two weeks but what i can easily do is just like park on the road and cut another one 
you know what i mean so i'm gonna show you guys more of the flowers which they say are weeds because i believe in having flowers in my room watch just these now but anyway guys i will see you tomorrow tomorrow is wednesday and um i'm going to work in the morning i finish a bit early and what do i have planned out for tomorrow hmm. Hmm, groceries oh i don't have food guys today like being like what's left in your cupboard guys like i literally had a sandwich with like bread and my last egg and i had tuna i had mayonnaise like being forced and jay so next week i'm really really tomorrow i really need to buy groceries guys so i want to show you my outfit right i want to show you guys what i'm wearing and also i've been going to the gym and honey one thing about me, ne, I'm extra. My body's extra. My face is extra. I believe in emphasis. Like, I'm already pretty. And when I put in effort, honey, you see the results. And I've been going to the gym, I think, for three days now. And this is doing what it should be doing. Okay? I'm wearing these jeans, which you all know by now, from Cotton On. The bodysuit is from Shein Earrings. Uh, from sheen as well and then the hairband is from aliexpress the wig is from aliexpress and then i'm wearing my slides from timu now guys this week now i thought would see it was the end of an era for it because like i really messed it up here in front like i sent a shape and i combed it and i did all these kind of things until i saw a fellow colleague of mine wearing hairs and she looked cute with a hairband and i was like let me stop slipping on myself so guys, I will see you when I see you. channel welcome back to day two of this vlogmas number two vlogmas two um today's the 20th of december and it is a tuesday i just no it's a wednesday it's a wednesday i just woke up as you can see my face is swollen yeah but i had enough rest i'm happy about that i slept like a baby um i ended up not studying because i was just lying to myself i got to my room at 11 p.m and i just couldn't do it like i just couldn't do it so i just passed out just passed out so i am going to work now within the next 10 minutes and i'll be back the side at around just after 12 p.m and then at least I can get my day started. So I'll see you guys then. If you're watching and if you're enjoying, please do not forget to comment, to like, and to subscribe. Oh, and the other reason I came outside this morning is I wanted to check on my plant, on my um, tomato plant that a client gave me. So I think it's doing well and it's growing. So I'm happy about that. hi guys what's up and welcome back to my vlogmas part two guys the last time you saw me was in the morning and i was just like so tired and so over it but i'm back from work i've had some time to chill and just you know be by myself so right now it is around half past 4 p.m 
yep it is around half past 4 p.m and i'm actually just going to get my car fixed i want to get my car fixed so i'm going to fix the wiper at the back that's the first thing that i'm gonna do today and then after that i'm gonna go to town and do some grocery shopping yeah so i'll see you guys later on also guys like i'm having a challenge when it comes to recording right because this is like the best part of my room where i get like good lights you know good lighting but my bed is currently here so i'm just trying to figure out what to do in order to still use this side of my room but anyway guys i just want to show you my outfit i look so cute it's not even funny i'm wearing this um i don't know if it's a corset top corset corset from shein i'm wearing my tights from small street and then i'm wearing my sandals and an anklet which i cannot put together so i had to tie it around and my shoes and the anklets are also from sheen i'm not gonna wear earrings because i feel like i'm just gonna be a whole lot of like gold going on but yeah guys i'll catch you later because i need to leave it's getting a bit late <laughs> And you know, she told me, and she's giving them to me for hundred dollars. Yeah. I thought during the the music like it's cheap, isn't it? Wait, you? Not today. Me, I'm going to work. Yeah. Guys, when are we going to the beach? When's the next shoot? Yeah. Tomorrow. No, no, look at the bars. Oh, I'm going to do that. Yeah. Look at the bars. I'm going to do that. Oh, really? You and who? But I am not. Who's going? Well, all the kids. Watch, watch. 
It's just me, Joshua. Joshua, no to me. It's just me, Joshua, and Chico. My turn, Garbasa. Probably. Oh, same for the ice cream. And Tapatwa. What? Me nang zoring same seven zero. Okay. Can you cancel your? part two the conclusion of this one which was basically a few days in my life i think about three days if i am not mistaken yo guys i'm so tired i just came from shopping like i said i needed to buy a whole lot of groceries because i was literally on zero i had no food at all like i was starving and it was so embarrassing and because Eighteen, eighteen, Guarana. It's taking me back to Raleigh. Hey? <sighs> Mixed with some red wine. But anyway, um, yes. So basically, for those that do follow my channel, I have mentioned that I am in the process of getting my own stuff, like for my own place, for when I eventually start staying with my children. So I'm just planning and getting as much things as i can and so there's a week whereby i spoil myself and there's a week whereby i don't spoil myself obviously i save every week but there's a week whereby i'm allowed to like blow money you know just spend my money so today i edit on my stuff but because this is the first time that i'm doing this i think i'm just going to show you guys what i've bought so far and I'm gonna be quick about it because I hate doing these things. Like I get irritated very fast. So number one, I bought a kettle, obviously. And then today I got a dinner set. And then I have these for my children, for my babies. Just some cups. A bowl, bowls, plates. And then these are uh, what I these things I got them a while ago. Like I said, guys, I want like theme for my home. I want like a nude green. So this is the colors. These are the colors that I'm going for. I'm going for this color. You see something like that. So this is a frying pan and some dish cloths. And I'm black. So basically, the theme is going to be black, white, and like a nude green. And then a toaster right and a tongue a pillar spatula na 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 a whisk was it a whisk oh it was a whisk a brush for doing the dishes um some cutlery though i saw like green cutlery i might just give this one to my mom and stick to the color that i want and also some chopping boards and the last but not no actually lastly some glasses which are green so guys everything is just baby steps it's just praying and it's just trusting the process because at the end of the day we serve a god that answers prayers and there's a saying that says do your best and the lord will do the rest so i cannot expect to be at a certain point in my life at a certain time if i don't meet god halfway and that is by saving and by like getting started you know so yeah let me just put these back it's giving hoarders. 
Guys, if there's something that I hate doing with everything in me, it is unpacking groceries. I hate doing that. I don't mind spending the money to buy the groceries. I don't mind. But the process of taking it from my car to the house and to the fridge and the cupboard is just... Thank God I have children. Thank goodness I have children. And I cannot wait to have a husband as well because that's going to be his task to help me unload groceries from my car to the house. Guys, I hate showing what I bought. This is what I got. This is what I, even when it comes to clothes, hence I don't know what kind of influencer I'm going to be because I hate the entire process of changing into different things and saying this and this and this because it just drains my energy. I just feel like it's like, okay, you got clothes, you know, so what? But anyways, I... I'm in the process of packing my groceries. Like, I'm not even halfway done. And I'm just, like, so over it. I'm so over it. But I'm just going to show you guys a few things that I bought. Because I enjoy it when other hands are doing it. But I cannot seem to do it. Milk. Not even because of cereal or whatever. But because I like drinking my... Mocha in the morning and then I got some energy bars mostly for when I'm at work and I have to snack on something and I can't really I don't really make like a scuff tin when I'm going to work so these are just like work stuff snacking stuff what else am I gonna snack on I already packed it in the cupboard and then I got my fizzy drink as always I got some juice they were on special hence I got two of those some peanut butter for my oats but I forgot to buy bananas so I'm just mad at myself some cooking oil some strawberry jam like guys when I say I had nothing I mean I had nothing in terms of food a pumpkin I want to make some good food some wraps chicken no not chicken Smirnoff <laughs> 1818 um salad it has a salad dressing in it but I bought it mostly because of the cabbage I'm gonna use it to mix it with my lamb chops for when i cook lamb chops with bap. and then this is all my meat yeah the lamb pieces that i'm talking about and then some beef schnitzel obviously to make a stir fry i wanted to make tacos but i could use the beef schnitzel for the wraps that i got some steak obviously chicken nibbles which i make the same way that i make um chicken wings i like them better because i feel like they have more meat yeah some bacon obvious bacon is just an obvious thing you can't make groceries and not buy bacon some coleslaw which i have to eat today but what am i gonna make because i feel so lazy now pies which always bail me out when i don't feel like cooking and i'm hungry as fuck i was checking in the microwave and before you know it you have a full-time meal which is what i might probably eat today so yeah guys that's just about most of the stuff your paper obviously Tomatoes in there, kiwi fruit. I can't believe I forgot bananas. I'm so mad at myself. I'm gonna say that again. Some lettuce, which I need to eat as soon as possible because my lettuce always, always ends up getting ruined in the 
fridge. Some cheese. Trying something new. I've never tried Colby. It's my first time. Some crackers, which I'm going to have with my tuna and avocado. Oh, and some fruits again. So, guys, that's just basically what I got, okay? Guys, I don't have much to say except thank you for watching my vlog. Like, at this point, I'm just so tired. I'm just so done. Like, I'm just so... I'm literally just gonna cook. I think I'm gonna make some steak and veggies and a salad. Basically, Lala, because I'm driving like over 60 kilometers, over 120 kilometers going and coming back. So I need to get as much rest as I can, and there's gonna be hoisting and whatever involved. But guys, thank you so much for watching this vlogmas number two. Do not forget to comment, like, and subscribe if this is the comment, if this is the content that you like watching. And I hope that my life goes or goes to show that there's a God out there and that keep on keeping on. There was a time in my life, literally last year at this time, when 300 rand is something that I couldn't even touch. But because I kept the faith, because I know who my creator is, I knew it was, it was gonna come at the way of, like where I was gonna afford myself. I'm not even bragging, but I'm just showing you what God is capable of. So guys, I'll see you on the next video. And I know I haven't said anything about studying, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Bye!